Hello, welcome back to my channel. I really hope that this isn't too dark. I'm trying to do a try on haul in an easier setting and I'm really hoping this is it. But this room, this side of the house is quite dark and that side of the house is quite light. So I'm not sure how it's going to work. But anyways, I'm rambling. I'm doing a primer haul. I'm really excited. I got some awesome bits and I really can't wait to show you all. I'm just gonna pick up the bag and get them out. The first thing is this dress. This I actually have worn already. Okay, so this is this brown. It's like a old-fashioned brown. I will, I don't know if I'm disappearing, but it's that long. I can't see myself now <laughs> really far. But it's like cinched at the waist and it's got these really pretty really arms i don't know if you can hear me i really hope you can just really comfy i wore it with some trainers to the park and i actually had quite a few compliments from it it was super affordable it was 15 13 pound i think it was and i bought it about a month ago so i wasn't going to include it in this haul but when i went to buy these things i saw it so it's still in stores if you wanted to get it really comfy thumbs up from me so this is the second dress, it's so pretty, it's this really um, soft pink colour and it has like a little um, cincher, like a cord, so you can cinch it in on the, way, on the waist. Uh, it's the same length as the other one, uh, but it's just really floaty, really pretty, I love the sleeves actually, It they are like really romantic and girly oh forgot one button these buttons though are an absolute pain to close okay got that um yeah so the buttons are a pain so hopefully you don't have to do them up or down i just did the one and then i gave up <laughs> and then i forgot to do it again but it's got this really long slit so it shows off my knees and i don't know i just think it's really girly i think this would be really pretty for like a baby shower or like a christening or just something a little bit more special um for like daytime special so i like i don't know even a wedding it'd be quite cute uh with some heels i don't know it's really summery really pretty i love this i didn't think i was gonna like it as much as i do but even the colours is really, really pretty. Before I take this off, I'm just going to show you some shoes that I purchased. And these are the best purchases ever. It's these mules. They are like, I don't know what material that would be. But it's like bag material. Like It's really stiff. And the heel is manageable. It's daytime manageable actually like I would wear these to the park or like just anywhere they're really pretty they totally do not look like they're from Primark I think I've seen them in Zara for like 30 upwards and these were 12 pounds 12 pounds which is insane I just couldn't believe my luck which is why the absolutely insane thing of buying this pair right because I really wanted these. I saw these first and I was like, I need those shoes. Let me put these down. I was like, I need those shoes and they are just so pretty. I think they would look good with absolutely anything in the summer. So I went to the Westfields of Primark and the shoes were upstairs, but then I was like, I'm sure I saw a mannequin at the front wearing them so I grabbed these these were a size 7 I'm a size 5 so they're big I took them downstairs because I wanted to check what the mannequin was wearing so that I could swap them and the mannequin was wearing a size 5 yay so I went up to somebody and I said can we swap them please and she said no so I bought the size 7s they are huge. I'm going to have to exchange them. But I just, I, I didn't want to try them on in store because there's never anywhere to sit. And I had my son and he has my patience for shopping. So I just kind of grab and get out, which is what I did. 
but I'm gonna have to go in and change these up. The only thing about this, which actually I just realized, is the toe bit. This is fabric, which means if you have any sort of dirty toes, it will show up because it's like a stone color. Um, stone color, like a bone color, and so you better make sure that you have clean feet every time you wear these. But I'm really hoping I can find these. I actually hadn't realized how similar this is to the dress that I was wearing at the beginning of the video. It looks a lot like this dress, so the polka dots are obviously a lot more sparse. But this one was from Zara and it was £40 and this one was from Primark. It's like a mini dress, so it's a little bit shorter. I don't tend to like shorter dresses. Um, it wraps up the back again. It has no sort of cute back. It's got these sleeves, which I'm actually not crazy about. I feel like it just adds more bulk. I don't know. Might be being crazy. Uh, but... It's just really cute. I think this would be sweet with some white trainers and I don't know, something else for like a picnic or just something casual like that. I just think it's really cute. Really sweet, essential dress. I don't know. It's nice. I'm not crazy about the length because I hate having my legs out. Um, but I don't know, I might give it a go. See? How I feel but now I'm just gonna move on to all the t-shirts I'm gonna find some pants first and then I'll be back I don't want to find some pants on hmm. wear some trousers I think that boobs look kind of weird the first top that I have which actually I haven't been up because I cannot be bothered but it looks like this it's like this blush pink color and it's in this satiny silky material it's got really big bone sleeves it has like a wrap thing at the waist i'm not sure if this goes to the back i think it might do um but it's just really cute it's kind of dressy i think it'd look nice if you were going out it's i think even for work this would be quite nice and office appropriate um, but yeah, I really like this. I think this would look quite cute with some white jeans or, I don't know, whatever you want to wear it with. Also, please let me know if you like this sort of setup where I'm just showing you the products on because I feel like when I'm watching a try on haul, I'm just waiting for the person to try it on and this way you can just see it as I see it. Okay, so this is the next top. It's uh, like that length. I probably wouldn't wear it like that. I'd wear it either tucked into my jeans or like rolled up, something like this. But I just love this color. They also had it in green and they had it in black. But I think this would be really pretty for this summer season. And I just really like it. It's comfy. I love the buttons. There's something a little bit more special and again I think you would find these in Zara or in Mango for a lot more than this. I don't know how much this was actually. Can you see? I'll find out when I take it off. Okay and this is the last top. This is actually my favourite one. I think there's like so many ways you could wear this and it stays because it's got this um stretchy bit on the shoulders really though so I might have to get something to shut it because I don't like very revealing things but it's really sweet it's so pretty when I saw it I even love the material it's like this milkmaid sort of back which you could also wear backwards should I try on backwards see how it looks I think that would look quite cute. But yeah, I love this. I'm actually going to wear this tonight to a date night that I have. And if you want to know how I would style any of these pieces, then you're more likely to find them on my Instagram. Not just trying them on, but actually wearing them, which is Ines Lepikes. I will link it somewhere. But I'm going to try this on backwards because I think it'd look quite cute.
Okay, so this is it on backwards. Did I put it on right? Is it centered? Kind of centered. So you can bring it up so that it's quite square. I think I like it more like that. And then it's got like a really low back. I think this is a really cute top and it's really see through as you can see. You can see, hopefully, you can't see my nipples. I kind of thought about that. Otherwise, this will be a waste of a top. I guess you could wear them with nipple covers. I'm wearing a see-through bra. It's a lace bra underneath. So I'm now really self-conscious that my nipples aren't show. I'm going to try the next one. I had lied before. I had one more dress, which is this one. It's this pink. I've not wrapped this up enough. Um, it's this pink dress with maroon polka dots. I'm wearing my jeans underneath, I hope it's not noticeable. And it's really long. It's far longer than any of the other ones. But it's just really pretty. It's really flowy. Again, it'd be really easy to, wow, show my vagina. Um, it's a really accessible split. Okay, so you have to walk really carefully because this might expose you. It's, it's, it's actually really pretty apart from that. But I really like it. I like the sleeves. It's like a little theme that I have going on with like the more flowy sleeves and the polka dots. I'm sorry if you don't like polka dots or flowy sleeves. But it's summer and this is what I'm into right now. I think that's really good for however much this was, which I'm guessing a lot less than any Zara dress. £15. That's really good. Really cute. I really like it. I've been babbling on for a very long time now. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please subscribe to my channel. I'd be eternally grateful. I haven't done a Primark haul in a little while, but I think I'm going to do these a little bit more regular. I am into styling videos and I think I'm going to do a couple of those soon and mummy videos so if you're mummy I definitely think you should subscribe and even if you're not you should do it. Thank you so much for watching I hope you have a lovely day and until my next video I will see you guys soon. Bye!